But what if we could just set up a reverb and it's got spectral unmasking built in? That's what Aurora does. And look how quick and easy this goes. Engineers, it's time for, believe it or not, another unmask tool. Another spectral unmasker has hit the market. And for once, I'm not going to have Sooth 2 Killer in the title because this one's different. This one is a reverb that uses the input signal to mask out the reverb, creating space for your signal. I think this thing is revolutionary in putting these two things together in one package. Super easy to use, sounds great, ludicrously cheap price. It's 49 bucks, but if you own any paid Isotope product, anything, any of their little elements packages, any little deals you've gotten over the years, if you've got a license for that, it's only 39 bucks. The QR code will be up the whole time. Scan it to get the best deal around on pluginboutique.com. Are you guys ready to have your minds blown again? Let's get it. Now this is a really common technique. This is something that I've been doing uh, with my reverbs and delays, ducking the signal going into them or after them to create space for the vocal and we don't get clouding from reverb tails and delay tails mingling over the vocals and muddying them up. So yeah, so we've got to, you know, put in our reverb send. We're going to send to it. Let's take a look at that kind of workflow that I've been doing in all my mix templates. Then usually in front of it, I'll put a dynamic EQ. And we find the fundamentals of the vocal, the ones that are really triggering the, the reverb too much. Let's say the big basso profundo tone, and then up somewhere in the mids, the honks, that'll get that reverb tingling too much. Maybe a bit in the highs as well. Now, in recent times, I've changed that flow to do the masking with a spectral plugin like Smooth Operator, Sooth 2, or now Curves Equator from Waves. In that case, I'll put the Curves Equator on sidechain input from the vocal and put that after the reverb. So it's a bit of work, but what if we could just set up a reverb and it's got spectral unmasking built in? That's what Aurora does. And look how quick and easy this goes. So let's have a little walkthrough of Aurora. 
Up here we've got the header section. This gives you some controls over the mode of the reverb, bypass, presets, the reverb and knob here, it's your wet dry mix. If you're in insert mode, is your reverb volume, if it's in send mode, pre-delay and reverb tail goes up to 15 seconds, which for a reverb junkie like me, that's great news. High pass and a low pass filter. These are applied to the reverb signal itself, the unmasked threshold. Pulling this down, we'll start to unmask based on the input signal to the reverb. And it'll apply this masking effect to the output of the reverb. Here we have the power button, which when engaged is normal operation. When using it as an insert, it'll turn off the unmasking. Now you've got attack and release controls, so you can fine tune when the tail can come in and when it starts unmasking. I've had great results with really short attack times, up to zero milliseconds, and uh, longer release times. It depends on the program, though. You'll find you'll find the way. And like most of these unmasked tools, there's a sensitivity button. This is going to tell it to react strong, more strongly to the input signal. Next to it is the ear ball, which uh, will give you the delta. You can hear what the unmasking is taking out. We've got a stereo width. You can go from all the way to mono, all the way up to crazy spread out stereo sound. And then the tone control, which will shave off lows and highs depending where you put the slider. But it's cool, I'm getting like wet on the long notes. And as he pushes, he actually gets drier. So this is really cool. Great. It pushes harder and you get slightly less of your early reflections. And you can put a lot of reverb on. Let's maybe try the snare. I make this stuff for you guys because I know that you want it. And I, if you want to get a discount price, take advantage of it. But you know what? Pass it on to the next generation of you guys. Engineers, if you're enjoying this video, then I please ask that you like and subscribe. Hit that bell, because I'm going to be making lots of these videos. You want to be getting these inside deals and tips the moment they come out. Also, for members of my Patreon, the live stream video of me demoing Aurora has been up on Patreon. 
for a day already. So, if you're enjoying what I do and want to support and get deals and news early, subscribe to my Patreon. You can join for free or as little as $3 a month. Back to Aurora. And a person still living. It's something short. Forgive themselves for what they lose. Snare room. What do you know? With the power of thought, it'll be okay. With some magical potion. The chain. Oh, nice. Washed away. Wow, that's great. So let's see. Let's check the delta on this. Interesting. You're getting just the fun tail. Events in life where we have to choose. I love that slap on the voice. The I love this uh, snare the too. It's great. Things are often forgiven. Events in life where we have to choose. Okay, an overhead group. Try a little reverb on that. I'd be tempted to try that same snare one. Cracking room could be interesting. Expand overhead. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. Look at that. Yeah, it certainly expands the overhead. Forgive themselves for what they lose. And they with the power of thought it'll be okay Amazing. with Very some cool. magical potion so with these low input signals it can turn up the sensitivity I guess Wow, that's really cool. That reminds me of Sound City a bit. The chain washed away. Things are often forgiven. Events in life where we wow, much wider. Very, very nice. Person still living. Okay, this is great. Let's maybe put the out kick in a room. So that's Isotope Aurora. I think it is the future of reverb. It would have been one thing if it was a good unmasker. It'd be another if it was a great reverb, but it's actually both. These reverbs sound incredible. Don't miss out on the deal now at Plugin Boutique. Remember, if you own any Isotope product whatsoever, you get $10 off the price, only 39 bucks. Scan the QR code and get the deal. Until next time, Let's get it.